everyone, welcome to In the Kitchen with Tyler. Today, uh, we're gonna be making... Ramen? No, not just any ramen. But... Ramajan. I'll, I'll show you what I mean. So basically, what I'm doing is, I'm making... Ramen, but... With Parmesan. That simple. Here's what you'll need. Literally just ramen. A pot. Uh, if you want to, a colander. I like to drain mine. I don't know. Um, water. Because, you know, you need to boil it and stuff. Parmesan, of course. Doesn't matter what kind, but I like this one. And a bowl and fork, because you need that to eat it. <laughs> First, preparation. Now, you may realize I'm lying on the job right now, but my hands will help me. Um, they're, they're my helpers. <laughs> they help me get around and do stuff, so good on them. Anyway, what you'll need to do first, you take your ramen and you just smash it up. I like to punch it first. Crunch it up like this and, uh... Zzz, uh come on! Open! There we go. And with the Power Movie Magic, I got chicken flavoring. You take that out, put that like that, and you should have three... If, if you're making uh, three packs of ramen, like I am right now, because I'm a hungry bastard, um, <laughs> and what you'll need to do, you'll need to open up this cabinet. <laughs> well, if you have a cabinet, that is. Um, shoot, camera. <laughs> anyway, uh, you take out a measuring cup or whatever. Close that. Uh, then you should have your pot nice and ready to go. Now, since I'm making three ramen packets, um, what you'll need to do, you'll need to get your cup under the sink and uh, fill it up, just like so, and then put it in the pot like so. You should have one cup, two cups, three cups, four cups, five cups, and finally six cups. Then put it on your stove top, like so. Eh. Alright, there we go. And now turn on the stove top. Look at it burn. Look at that, man. Oh my god, my camera! And once you've done that, just wait for the water to boil. Just waiting for this to start boiling. It's boring. Hey, Tyler! Oh god, Patrick, why are you huge? Uh. I don't know. Anyway, what are you doing? Uh. Well, I'm making ramen. Why? Oh, I don't know. I just wanted to know. Uh, hey, a bull! Hey, pa Patrick! Patrick, please! Hey, wait a minute. Where's the Parmesan? Did you put it away? Maybe. Now oh, I gotta go check the fridge. Of course he did. Gotta grab the Parmesan again. What an idiot. Alright, I gotta make the Parmesan up here. And... Movie... Magic. There it is. Okay. Cool. Uh, now we just gotta wait for the pot to boil. Patrick, get out of here. You know what? I'm sending you to plush prison. Get out of here. <laughs> Stupid fucking idiot. My pot's finally boiling. Jeez. Alright, so what you'll do, uh, I, I gotta... Hands, please help. Thank you, hands. The hands are like the god of my universe. Anyway, take your ramen, and, uh, you just kinda do this. Kinda just put the... Take, take the ramen and you just kinda eat it in there. Once you did that, throw your packets away because frick the packets, am I right? Go in there. Stay away. Now grab a spoon or whatever you want to use. Take it out. Then uh, just start stirring. Of course, that's not how you stir, you freaking idiot hands. Stir the correct way. There you go. We just gotta kinda leave it cooked now. Um, not really much I can say here. Hey, <laughs> I'm about to end this man's whole career. I'm gonna turn up the heat. <laughs> That's the wrong way! There you go. <laughs> Alright, well, might as well check on the ramen now. Oh my god, it's overflowing! What, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Uh, uh, um, uh... Who did this? Who did this? I don't know. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna turn down the heat. 
Phew. Okay. Well, that was a close call, guys. Well, uh, I'll wake up when it's ready, I guess. Gosh darn it! I'll never foil his plans. Well, might as well leave. You know what? I'll watch the best of this. Who cares? I'll just be, uh... Oh, frick! Mm, I fell! Uh, I'll, just, I'll just be up here. Just watch him. Alright, I'm pretty sure the ramen's done. Next thing to do is turn off the heat. There you go. Now, this is what I do, but your kitchen is probably different from mine. Take your colander and you put it right in the sink like that. Uh, just put the thing over there. Grab some oven things. I only need one because I've already got one over here. But uh, you take both hands like this. You take the thing over here and you... Uh, well, I bored in the colander right now, but it's freaking diagonal for some reason. Oh, never mind. Movie magic helped out. Alright, let's, uh, let's put the thing in here now. You gotta be very careful when you put this stuff in the colander. Because if you don't, you'll burn yourself. And ah! Next thing you do, you take your colander, and you just kind of do this. Wiggle all the water out. You guys probably know how to drain stuff, right? It's just a simple process of just moving, getting the water out of stuff. <laughs> yep. Once you think it's drained enough, which I think mine is, go back to the pot with, like, no water in it, and just put it in there. It looks like that for some reason. Then put the, the colander in there. <laughs> then what's next, if this lid would move out of the way, is to put the chicken in there. Or whatever flavoring you have. I eat chicken ramen. It's the best flavor in my opinion. Anyway, next what you do is you open them up. Just like so. Uh, just kind of open it. And then just pour it on your ramen. Just like this. And then basically repeat the process for the other two. Because I cooked three, I am a fat fuck. Once you've done that, you can take your packets and whatever and throw them away. Just like the ramen packets. Get out of here. Oops, I can't do that. Once you've done that, just throw away the packets. There you go. Then the last thing you want to do for your ramen is uh, stir up the chicken. If you stir it enough, you can teleport over to your table or whatever with movie magic. Yeah, it's that easy. Anyway, once you're at your bowl, oh man, this looks golden and debunkable. But anyway, once you're at your bowl, you put some ramen in your bowl. I'm gonna do that with movie magic as well. Movie magic. There's ramen in the bowl now. And now for the final step. Wait, wait, wait a minute. I forgot the salt. Stupid salt, forgot about you. I put, that's right, even more salt on the ramen than there already is. Because I'm funny like that. That's so funny. And finally, the final touch. You grab your parmesan, because this is ramajan, not ramen, you idiot. Can't believe I tricked you. Unless I didn't, then I'm an idiot. Dang it, I'm just gonna put some parmesan in here now. Yeah. Get it all on there. Mmm, it looks like a snowy mountain. Then you close your parmesan. And if you're me, you can go over here and you can put the parmesan in the fridge. There you go. Stick your fork in and look at that. Beautiful ramajan. Well, that's kind of it for this episode of In the Kitchen with Tyler. Uh, hope you guys like the series and maybe we'll come back to it. I don't know. I'm stupid. <laughs> yeah, if you like this, then like it, leave a like, or whatever, comment if you want, I, I don't really care. <laughs> if you like this episode, leave a like, and comment. Do it. Do it right now, I'm watching you. Make a comment. I'll be waiting. If you didn't make a comment already, what are you doing? Make a comment. Anyway, that's it for this episode. Uh, see you guys in the next one if we do another one of these, because I'm boring. <laughs> um, bye. Ah!